Hello, this is Alanga Maestro, here to just give a few tips on when you're feeling a little creative drain and you don't want to work on your main projects. There are some things that I basically do to keep myself motivated and make sure I have something coming out, even though I don't particularly feel like it. Okay, so my first tip, role-playing. Role-playing is always a great way to go when you want to develop something. You basically have plenty of character development. Choose your Mary Stews or Gary Stews and let them rip. Let them explore worlds they never would have explored. Make character sheets and let them meet other people. It's a pretty great thing. You can expect a lot of crazy situations and naturally a lot of fun. And it's basically a gold mine when it comes to creative writing. So I'll definitely recommend that. Second tip, fan fictions. I know they have a bad reputation, but... Okay, sometimes the reputation is well-deserved, but they're actually pretty good when it comes to exercising those creative muscles. For one thing, they're pretty easy to feel motivated about when writing. When you're writing about your favorite series in any form, it's always a really exciting process. It's uh, also a great training for what-if situations when you're making your characters meet things they never supposed to meet spin-offs and mishmashs and what have you it's a really interesting creative thing you can either go realistic you can follow the laws of the universe you're parodying or or writing fan fiction about or you can just go insane and just let it rip so that's always great it's also a great way to meet other readers with similar interests no matter what fetish or exciting tag or trend you're going with you're sure to find someone who's interested so it's always a great way to meet readers my final tip is prompts and competitions plenty of ways to find these things online even on mangaraders.com itself this is the best way to get experience in my opinion it's not easy to get into because you're going to pit yourself against other writers but because you're pitting yourself against other writers it's a great way to gauge your writing level and exercise those muscles for when you get into the big leagues, for when you submit yourself for real competitions, for competitions that get you paid, basically, and the like. I can't say anything else other than it's not easy, but it's an important way to get your muscles flexed. I think that is all I have for now. When I have more tips, I'll be sure to share them. For now, I'll be gone. Peace.